the first step is that we take lobster shells, we crush them up, and then we use an acid and alkali solution to strip away mineral and protein layers to get at the chitin nanofibers. We can then add that chitin powder to household vinegar, and that gives us a bioplastic solution. And then we use that solution with our custom-made machines to be able to form three-dimensional things. It's antifungal and antibacterial, which means that it would be really interesting for storing foods. And at the end of life, it's actually a non-polluting fertilizer. So even if you had a bag at home, you could just chop it up, throw it into your plant pots, and it would just help them grow. to one uh, lobster chain within London. And what we found is they actually have 375 tons of lobsters going to waste every year, which means chitin content-wise, that's 125,000 kilograms. And um, from that, every year, we could make about 7.5 million plastic bags.